And welcome back on this Tech Tuesday. You know, new smart technology is designed to make your home and life uh, easier, more comfortable, even safer. Yeah, Greg Nibbler from Digital Trends is here uh, to talk about some of their picks for the best ways to add a little extra tech IQ to your house. Good morning. Good morning. Yes, yeah, so we've got all kinds of coverage of smart homes and smart home devices at Digital Trends. But I want to bring in just kind of maybe a starter pack here. So these okay, are actually okay. devices at my house mm -hmm. that I, I brought in. You brought all these in from I brought them in from my home, so okay. I'm disconnected right now. Um, but I wanted to start off. So if somebody wanted to get into smart homes, so you're mm -hmm. probably familiar with these, but I'm not sure. Yeah. This is an Amazon Echo Dot mm -hmm. and then the Google Home Mini. So these okay. are kind of like a real base level to get in. Yeah. Now you've got speakers on here. Um, I use these as kind of alarms in, yeah. my, in my bedroom, so oh, it's gotcha. like I can actually you know, talk to it, you can set alarms, you oh, can do all that nice. stuff. Oh, that's nice, you don't have to like, have your phone, because I yeah. hate having my phone as exactly. my alarm, because right. I just start scrolling from the minute I wake up. Yep, mm -hmm. and then I set it across the room, so yeah. I can't turn it off as easy, um, but oh, you you know, that's for my own problem. So that's uh, <laughs> that's kind of starting off. So these things are, are pretty easy to get into. You're looking at anywhere from, there's always deals, but 20 to $50, depending on which one you get. Yeah, yeah. are but, there any kind of security concerns with this? I know people are always a little like, yeah. heebie-jeebies yes. about, you know. <laughs> the, yeah, and that's certainly something that has come up uh, quite a bit, so I would recommend if if, and we've got guides for this too, um, two-factor authentication. Okay. Mm. So when you're setting it up through your app, make sure that you have that on, make sure you update it constantly. Yeah. So if there are updates, let it run those updates. Right. Um, those are some different ways that you can kind of make sure that you're, you're keeping secure on that. For the most part, it's not as big a concern as, as it may seem to be, but yeah, yeah, definitely stay up to date. Definitely make sure you put two factor. We have like five of them in our house, and no one's ever yeah. talked to us. Okay, yeah, yet. that's good. Maybe the that's hackers good. are watching right now. I gotta, get on, right. I gotta yes. get on the smart speaker thing. But you do. Okay, so up next, a smart <laughs> light bulbs. I heard about yeah. this. What's going on here? Yeah, so smart light bulbs. This is another great way to kind of change up your house. You can save energy with them. You can actually set timers, so you can set your lights to go on, go off at any time. We're kind of seeing right there. There's some good examples of some smart light bulbs. You can. Um, control them anywhere. So say yeah. you leave the house, you forget to turn them on or off, you can do that. Or you get home and your house is dark, you wanna make sure there's light on, mm -hmm. turn them on right there from your phone or through your it's smart It's like speaker. the modern day setting a timer on the plug kind of thing, yep. right? right? Okay, Yep, so you can cool. change them anytime. Very neat. I brought in this one from my house. This is kind of ridiculous. It's got a Bluetooth speaker in it. So oh. you don't <laughs> necessarily have to have that part of it, but that's just kind of another example of some different smart home lighting, different things you can Very do. Very cool. Different color swatches. And mm -hmm. do most of them fit into your regular Most of them are not this giant. Okay. Thing okay. I have right here. Yeah, so you would just check, normal. but yeah, it's got like the like the regular socket to twist in here kind of thing, right? Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Yep. Yeah. So they all just fit into normal stuff, and you can instantly like change a room up, set it for a theater Very setting. Cool. Love yeah. it. Yeah. Really fun. Okay. So I had never heard of this smart plugs. Yeah, like I don't really understand what a this is all plug? about. So this is the way to take something dumb from your house and make it smart. Yeah. Okay. So what I do with this oh. is, you know, you can take this, you can plug anything into it. Yeah. Uh, put it in. You hook it up to your your whatever your smart home system that you've got, and then you turn an item into smart because it can turn it on and off. So the example right there that we just showed was a fan. That's what I use it for at home. Oh, I love so I've it. got, a fan. I like to have a fan on when in my bedroom. So I can actually talk to my speaker and say, hey, yes. turn on fan, turn it off. I wow. can program it to turn on, turn off at different times. Say you've got coffee maker, anything else that you really, you want to turn into a smart That is device. amazing. It's Wait, and how much are those? This, I think this one was about 10 bucks. Oh my gosh. There's deals what? all like the time. Like on Amazon? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and then you can go them. up and get even fancier ones. And we've got, we've got a whole guide actually just for these. Just Your for home's going to be so smart. We're going to be so I know, right? smart. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Once you start down the path, it gets pretty addictive, actually. Yeah. <laughs> and that's what leads me to this. So this is the Amazon Fire TV Cube, and this mm. is one that I've got in my house. So this is essentially an entire home entertainment system in this box. Wow. So it does everything that these speakers do, and there's other versions and other companies make things similar, but this is pretty great because it's the entertainment system, meaning it hooks up to your television. You walk in, and you can basically just say, hey, uh, turn on news AM extra and yeah. it'll turn it on. I love oh. it. Boom, there it is. We love that. Yes, exactly, <laughs> exactly. It makes it nice and easy for everybody and it's got every every streaming platform on there so you don't need another device. Yeah. yeah. You can actually run it all through this. Oh. All in one little all box. All by your cool. voice. Very, very cool. Mm -hmm. Very right. fun. Greg, thank you so much. Hey, don't forget, you can check Greg out 9 a.m. Digital Trends Live, so tune in and watch their show and find more advice on all of this stuff and more at coin.com. Just check out this story. Yeah.